where my soul was free. On our new floating home, I'm Rosalinda Roman, and this is New Mexicast. Welcome back to New Mexicast, everyone. I'm Rosalinda Roman, and I am so glad you're here. It is a very exciting time. If you've been following my blog posts, you know that my family's big exciting news is that we moved onto a boat. Yes, a boat. I am recording this right now from Green Turtle Key in the Bahamas, and so far it's been an amazing adventure, which I will continue to share in bits and pieces along the way for those of you that are interested here on New Mexicast. But it's not just this boating business that has us so excited around here. When I decided to move aboard, I knew I wanted to make sure to keep New Mexicast the quality enchanting video podcast that you all have come to know and love and in order to do that I knew I needed some help. Well I couldn't have asked for a better person to add to the New Mexicast team than the guy I'm about to introduce you to. His name is Brian Cady and for more than 18 years he worked in both the technical and editorial sides of news at CNN. During his time there he covered major stories like 9-11 and Hurricane Katrina just to name a few. Well lucky for for us, he actually has a very independent spirit and he also shares my love of New Mexico. Brian has agreed to shoot some stories for us here on New Mexicast in the Land of Enchantment while I continue to go wherever the wind might take us. So, for his first assignment here on New Mexicast, we decided to go with a subject that kind of bridged the gap between living on a boat and living in New Mexico. Fishing. Well, from the little bit of very unsuccessful fishing we have attempted here on board, it is clear that a little bit of help and training goes a long way. So for Brian's fly fishing adventure, we turn to the experts at Land of Enchantment Guides to help introduce us to the art, yes, it is an art, of fly fishing and fly tying. His guide was Noah Parker, who has spent a lifetime on the water, and with his expertise combined with Brian's expert eye, we were able to put together this sensory delight you're about to see. Hey, the wind's blowing upstream, bro. That's a good thing. Today we're fishing on the Chama River. We have probably 50 miles of different kind of water fish on the channel. Whoa! <laughs> what a greedy fish. I don't know how this fish did it. It ate both my flies. Oh, wow! Let it run, let it run. Don't hold your rod. You know, there is a learning curve to fly fishing. Um, but it's not that great of a learning curve. And if you start, you know, with a little good instruction, it won't take you that long. Uh, I certainly can't cast like in a river runs through it, but I like to think I can cast enough to catch a few fish and have a good time. Oh, Tate on the Denny, oh, it's on the stone fly. Me heart is broken. This is a stone fly nymph, one of the bigger fluid sources. This is one of my patterns that I really like. There's no bigger charge than coming up with a fly pattern and then coming out to a river like this, casting out the fly that you might have tied the night before, like I know that's got to work, and wham! Oh, wow. Hooking into a nice trout like that. How can you beat them apples, you know? <laughs> Woo! Yeah! I've caught some pretty big fish here, you know, I assume. 26, 28 inch fish, but the most memorable fish I've caught were probably fish that were just in a gorgeous place. I was in a great frame of mind. The people I was with were great friends, and we were having a wonderful time. Whoa, there he goes. Those are real nice. Wow, that's a good one. Yep. Now there's a beautiful New Mexico rainbow. See that? Mm-hmm. Off he goes. 
like I said, a sensory delight. But of course, Noah and Brian only make it look easy. So for the fly fishing, if you're interested in trying it yourself, I highly recommend you contact Land of Enchantment Guides. They really know their stuff, and they can help people all the way from beginners who have never ever fly fished before, to people who are really expert anglers just looking to fine tune their skills a little bit. So definitely give them a call. And as for that amazing video you saw, again, that is the newest member of New Mexicast team, Brian Cady. He is awesome. I really enjoy working with him. And I hope you'll leave a comment telling him you want more from him here on New Mexicast. So we'd like to see more of his work in the future. Well, like I said, three enchanting people doing awesome things with their hands. Thank you to all of you for supporting New Mexicast. We'll see you again in a week. I'm Rosalinda Roman. Like a dream I had. New Mexicast theme song is New Mexico by Dorian Spencer. Additional support for New Mexicast provided by. Got my props back there, <laughs> fishing away. I'm not sure she even has anything on the line. Shh, don't tell anyone. <laughs> so this is the expert casting over here, hence the need for Noah's services. <laughs> Sorry, honey. What are you saying? I said, now we know we need Noah's services. Yeah. No, 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 no. No, Toba, you don't need it in your nose. You'll regret it. Yeah. All right, my extras have been cut from the scene. They're not there anymore. They, you know, too much. Are you done yet? Are you done yet? So. Hey. Yeah, I'm you're out of here. He's kicked out. All right, here we go. <laughs> As I was recording this, I had a, a friend at my foot, literally sitting on my foot. Where are you? A wet dog. Very wet dog. Hey Tova, did you have a good day? That's our, our salty dog. Tell me. This is my. This is. Ah! This is. Where 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 is. Should we start again? Say, hi, I'm Leah. And this is my sister Sophie, okay? <laughs> Good. And are you in New Mexico? Yeah. Yeah. Hi. <laughs> Ziva, you're not helping, honey. Sophie, say hi. I'm Sophie. Are you hi, working the I'm camera? This is, this is, this is my Ziva. Sister.